In this video, we're going to briefly discuss the AutoGuy functionality. And what AutoGuy lets you do is automatically add both an anchor and a guy wire to a structure and simultaneously set its lead angle, its lead length, and its attachment height so as to properly guy a structure. So let's take a look at the first thing we need to do, which is to tell it what guy wire anchor assembly we want to use. So here in my catalog, I have a, a single anchor with a down guy on it. I right click that and said I want that to be my auto guy assembly. All right, now if we look at this pole, what we can see is that it's clearly deflected in this direction because it's not guide at all. And what I do is I select the height at which I want guiding to occur and I tell it to perform an auto guy operation. It then pops up a window to allow me to set the lead length if I don't want to use the default lead length, but I'm perfectly happy with the default lead length, so I go ahead and say okay. And you'll see what it did was it automatically added. It used the deflection of the pole to decide at what angle it should be setting the lead length. It added the anchor, and then it selected, added the guy, put the guy bolt at the correct height, and it put in the guy wire that I selected. Now if we look at this pole, you can see, all right, now it's nicely guyed at the top, but clearly it needs to be guyed down here as well. Well, with the anchor selected, what I can do is right-click on the pole again and say I want to add an extra guy, and now you'll, you'll see down to that same anchor it adds an additional guy wire. And now we have a situation where it's going to pull the, bowl, the pole back in line if we wait a second. There we go. And I could add one in the comm zone as well if I wish to. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and do that. Say I'm going to add an extra guy there as well. And now I have a properly guide structure. And if we wait for it to get done calculating, it's going to think about it for a second. And then it's going to pop up and say, yep, everything's nicely in line. All my moments are good. My guys are all adequate. My anchors are adequate. And away we go. So that's auto guying. It's a fairly useful tool um, for doing initial guying uh, design for structures.